and get shell shot. That's my fam, I'll hold them down forever. Us against the world, we can battle whoever. Together ain't no way we Hello everybody. Uh, welcome back to another team builder. I completely forgot what I, was, what I was gonna say, but this time it's for the IPF. However, I'm still joined by the same guy. This is V Rage. Hey, what's up, everyone? V Rage here, and welcome back to another uh, team battle, team battle, team builder episode. It's a, it's a team battle episode. Team battle. Team battle. All right. So All right. So this week we're team building for the IPF for the first round match against the San Diego Septiles. I think it's our. I don't. I don't know. It's from a place that starts with S and it's septiles. So, a lot of them. <laughs> all right. All right. So. Um, so his team comprises the Mega Caesar as his Mega Amoongus and Excadrill from the OU picks, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, for some reason, I have a team that is just X Cloud. I don't. Well, I don't know why. I'm going to delete that. <laughs> All right, it's a new OU team. Add Pokemon. Okay, so for sure, for sure, for sure, a hundred percent, hundred percent. I am bringing Mega Charizard Y. Oh shit! I just, I just changed something by accident. What did you change? I don't know what I changed. Let me see what you changed. On the um, do you see the spreadsheet? Yeah. It says MEG on the A1. If you look at cell A1, it says MEG. I don't know what was there. I think that was in the, that was just tears, right? Yeah, that was just tears. Let me just undo. Undo. You, undo was doesn't work. Yeah, it did. Uh, it it says teams right now. <laughs> tears. There oh, it's supposed to. Uh, I just I just wrote I just wrote tears in. Is that right? Yeah, whatever. Just keep it like that. No wait, no no. Okay, cool. That's teams. It should be should be teams. Uh, uh, should be teams. I oh, got it. I just okay. it. All right. All right. Cool. All um, right. So yeah, with your Mega Charizard Y, which is the lesser of the two Charizards. Um, in your dreams. <laughs> you can. I'm only saying that because my mascot. But Me come on. Who got, uh, he finally got the Dragon type. <laughs> shiny, shiny male Mega Charizard Y. So with Mega Charizard Y. You can basically take out the Caesar, the Moongus, the Excadrill, the Gaventula, the Scrafty, and that basically is that. And that's like four or five mods right there. So almost half his so, team just goes down by the pure typing of the Charizard. Flamethrower. Are you going to go Solar Power or Drought? Charizard Y only has Drought. Oh, yeah, never mind. Uh, oh, yeah, Drought's legal. Okay, okay. So here's the thing is that I'm going to put Solar Beam on this thing. Yep. But Solar Beam, who would be that? Would, that's not, that's good for Claude, sir. He's probably gonna bring the Claude, sir, expecting you to or Lantern, expecting you to bring the Charizard because it is your Mega. So I definitely see him bringing one of those two. All right. So that's a and I'm yeah. Uh, all right. Let me pull up his. Okay, so I I can check the Galvantula, the Excadrill, the Among Us, the Scizor. The Lantern and the Clawitzer. Just with Mega Charizard. What next? What I mean next? what moves are we putting it on it right now? Solar Beam and Flamethrower, right? Yeah. Do you want to put Ancient Power on it? Or no? Four. I mean the Arcanine, like do you think he'd bring the Arcanine? Just to like, you know, like he'd be like, Why are you switching into um if he sees a fire I mean, doesn't Arcanine get flash fire? What if he goes flash fire expecting a fire type, but you just hit it with the ancient power? No. That's what I'm. That's what my process is. Or you can give him EQ and just do, but that's physical, not special. So. But his physical attack is still 213. So. That's e true. EQ will take him out. So EQ could take out what? Um, Caesar could take uh, Mungus, uh, Excadrill, Arcanine, Avantula does a lot. Yeah. It so won't take good. out Scizor. It won't take out Mungus. It would do a lot to Garbodor though. It will and a Lantern. It would probably and take out. No, Lantern is neutral. Oh, yeah, it's neutral. But then you have Solar Beam. But for the Garboder, that'd be good. That, that's super effective. So you're going to go... Yeah. So what are you going to do? Solar Beam? Uh... I can basically check his entire team just with Mega... 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 Charizard Y, Charizard, yeah. yeah. Are, are you going to run Heat Wave or no? No. So just Flamethrower, um, Solar Beam, and what, what are the last two moves? 
earthquake and uh, hold on I just want to take permissions okay no one else that is, is on has permissions to the room never mind do you want to give it willow or tailman uh, no I will give it uh... see this is the thing if it was a charge I'd actually give a dragon both that's what I'm saying. Dragon type. No, no. If I was if I was facing those Charizard decks, I'd give a dragon pulse. Oh well, yeah. Uh, do you want to give you want to give him defog just so you can de you can uh, defog any Rotten setup? Doesn't uh, or, doesn't Braviary get defog? Yeah, I think so. You, or, yeah, you want to give it, you should give someone else. Yeah, yeah, it's better to give it to someone else. I don't want to give a um, useless. Well, I don't give. I don't want to give. I want to give my Mega all damaging moves so I can just come in yeah, and wreck. True. How would you take care of that spirit tomb though? Because you have a spirit tomb in the FTL league, and we know how annoying that can be. Yeah. So he's de he's definitely gonna send out a Willow Whisper, I think. I see that, or you know, just status install. But he's gonna have pri yeah. If, he's gonna have priority. If no, how would he have? Priority? Well, he, he gets the shadow sneak. He would, he has shadow sneak with that. So yeah, he, but I feel like, yeah. Yeah, but dude, if he if he makes his his spirit tomb defensive, shadow sneak isn't gonna do much. Yeah. So, I, so don't need to, I don't need to worry about that. Plus, I could just hit him with an earthquake or a flamethrower, or I should give him a flying type move like air slash to flinch. Also, that's special. So it's stab. Yeah, that's and the same type attack bonus. Yeah. Stab special and has a chance to flinch. I'm 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 giving him air slash. So air slash, earthquake, uh, flamethrower, and solar beam. That's a good move set. I think. That's, yeah. That's nice. That's nice. So I'm giving him the hasty nature. Uh, he's a fast special sweeper. Uh, he's got 417 special attack and 124 physical attack. So that earthquake is still gonna is still gonna hurt. And I'm going to call him uh, the better V Rage. I, I had a feeling you're gonna put my uh, my gamer name in there and uh, have the pond. I'll I'll take it. Do well, Charizard. Why do well, or your counterpart will. Show you up. Though the funny thing is, I did not draft Mega Charizard X. I know. Idea. I was expecting you to, but then you were like, Mega Gardevoir. What? Mega Gardevoir. The complete opposite. Man. And the, the worst part is, Mega Charizard X got drafted literally right after you drafted Mega yep, Gardevoir. But I'm fine with that. I want a Gardevoir. I want a Gardevoir. So, All right. So I'm thinking Scolipede. So what? Swords Dance, Baton Pass, Speed Boost, stuff like that? Nope. No? Nope. Skull what is Scolipede checking this for you? Um, I don't know. I just want I just want, I just want you Scolipede. Because speed boost. So even if I I can also use poison point, but I don't want to. But here's the thing is um Like his his OU mons resist Scolipede like crazy, so Yeah, but uh, And he's gonna bring his OU and Arcanine and Gudra. So see, I, I actually I, I can I'm gonna run uh, wait, what does I'm gonna run uh, toxic. Okay, yeah, that would work. No, no, I'm not gonna bring Scolipede. because two of his mons uh, are steel type. Yeah, that's what I was saying. And Amoongus is poison, so like it'll be resisted most of the moves if you try to do it. And so he's gonna bring a mega. That's an extra drill. I feel he's gonna definitely bring. All right, so uh, I I wanted to bring Scolipede, but I'm not going to. Uh, if he's going to bring, yeah, I got. Uh, I'm gonna. He's gonna bring a Moongus. Who can I? I feel like he's gonna bring Mega Caesar, Excadrill, and um, Spirit Tomb. Spirit Tomb's iffy, but Mega Caesar and Excadrill for sure. I'm feeling. He didn't draft and... Spirit Tomb, so I don't know if he's gonna want to bring it. Oh, he didn't draft. Oh, okay, okay. That was that was uh, Inu. Okay, that's not. I like that's not a bad draft though. Uh, I'll see that Garbodor. I see that. I see that Lantern a possibility. Just so we can, like, you know, both his typings are good against your Charizard, so maybe. One of the water types. Either that Claw Assert or Lantern, definitely, too. Uh, so, for x points. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. I can bring Florges. But what about his Steel and Poison types? You got Excadrill, Amoongus, Mega Caesar. For the water types. Uh, oh, for the water types? For his Steel, well, his steel types, Mega Charizard. His poison types. We'll worry about that later. Well, Florgus is fairy, so yeah. But he learns, he learns a lot of grass type moves. Yeah, like energy ball, giga drain, and all that. She. Yeah, that's good. She he, it's it's either or. 
floor, I guess. Uh, I want... Oh no, it's just female. Never mind. I didn't know that. I want the red <laughs> one because red is awesome. Uh, flower veil. What's the other one? If an ally using an item, this Pokemon. No, no. There's no allies. This side's grass types can't have lower, lower have stats lowered or status. Okay, this is a double ability, so who gives a shit? I'm gonna give it dazzling gleam just because. Always. Uh, um, I, you wanna run energy ball? Possible special defense drop, and it's 90 at uh, 90 at power, 100% accuracy. Pedal dance. Oh, you're gonna do physical? Pedal dance is special. Pedal blizzard is physical. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, <laughs> the opposites. Uh, toxic. So you're not gonna run energy ball, right? Uh, um, you could run. No, I will run Giga Drain. Okay, yeah, that'd be good with the Because it's got recovery. Bulky Special Sweeper. Oh, shit. It's got an attack of 355. Its speed is 186. So I have to give it an item that boosts speed. You could choice it. Or I could... Because uh... what moves are you running on this thing? You're going to do Dazzling Gleam, uh, Giga Drain. Uh, what were the other two? Pedal Dance. Pedal Dance and, and Toxic. Okay, so... Um, with your set, you can do damage too. I'm going to give him the Quick Claw. Okay, interesting choice. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you're gonna. It's like complete luck at that point. Like if it's gonna pop or not. Um, Scrafty's basically screwed with your Florius right now. Um. Oh wait. Oh yeah, that doesn't leave my habit. I was like, wait, did I put a fairy type yeah. move on it? Yeah. Is that Garboder, the Excadrill, Amoongus, and Mega Caesar? That kind of, and of course Gudra, because it. Oh well, no, Gudra's dead, basically. <laughs> so. Wait, I am going to take out Giga Drain. And I'm going to give it, um... Protect? So you can protect Toxic Saw, maybe, if you want? No. I mean, to heavy, no. Uh, <laughs> toxic Saw. I'm going to give it... Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see... I could give it Solar Beam. I have to send it out after Charizard, though. Yeah, I mean, that's not bad. If your Charizard does somehow go down, you have another Solar Beamer ready to go. And But, like, who, Solar Beam only hits super effective on two of the mods, right? Yeah. Heal Bell. Okay, yeah, that's not bad. Heal Bell. So if, gonna if, probably... if he tries to, 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 to status me, I can just use, use Heal Bell. Yeah, that'll work. So I can status him and then heal whatever status he puts on me. Oh yeah, that's like it's aromatherapy, but yeah, same thing. So it's gonna be especially defensive instead. All right, not bad. That's good. So with a 262 special attack, it's still not that bad. But what if I take off the EVs and HP and give them the special attack? 322. I'm gonna run that. Are you gonna run speedy? Speedy? Like, are you gonna make it fast? Like investments in special attack and speed? Because Maddox is 249. You know what? Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Special attack and speed. It's still got 378 special defense, so that's still pretty pretty good. Alright. Let's do that. Just so you can outspeed maybe something on his team? like I don't know what, but still. like You're especially defensive, and... He seems to have a good amount of special attackers. Hey, Game Guide won. What happened? Game Guide, the Chelsea Krogunks won his his week three FTL ma FTL match. Oh, nice. All right, so uh, Mega Gardevoir, Roden Wash, Ferrothorn, Diamantan, Haxorus, Sableye, Hitmontop, Seismitoad. That's my team. Drapion, <laughs> Miltank, Scyther. Oh, that's a crappy lineup. Let's move to the set tiles. Uh, nah. <laughs> my my team is so much better than that, yo. Just see what I have in store for Inazuna. Just see. Yeah, I'm gonna. I, I, I spent hours yesterday just thinking. I'm like, I was going through scenarios. I I did some showdown analysis with the uh, like damage count. I'm like, I'm yellowing this with this. What I'm doing. All right. It's gonna be a hype battle. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna put uh, so I put Florgas. Um, 
the Neuvern I drafted for a specific reason, and then that's going to come up uh, uh, some other in another battle. So I'm not going to put him in here. Although I could, I, mean I could. No, wait, I could. What? What? What's the fourth move I get to Charizard? Um, air slash. Yes, air slash. Instead of Earthquake, I could give it Dragon Pulse for Gudra. Even though it's specially defensive, I think that, like... Hold on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna calculate. What about Dragon Claw? Dragon... No, wait, that's not Dragon. It's Showdown Damage Calc. Alright, I'm gonna calc it just, just to see. Uh, okay, if it can load. Okay. So, uh, Charizard... Uh, Mega Charizard Y O U uh, against Gudra. Uh, you you choice band whatever, same shit. Still specially defensive as fuck. Um, all right. So uh, an outrage from Gudra would kill me. I outspeed, so that's great. Solar Beam. Oh, because he yeah, has Sap Zipper. If he doesn't choose Sap Zipper, though. I feel like he might. Expecting a Chestnut or Solar Beam itself. I'm going to take Roost off of this because it's terrible. Uh, Dragon Pulse. Guaranteed one hit KO. Wait, oh, from no, a regular wait, wait. No, Mega Charizard Y? Sorry, that was on Outrage. It's guaranteed three hit oh. KO. Let's, okay, let's... he doesn't do damage. Dragon Claw, can he even learn Dragon Claw? To guaranteed three hit KO. But wait, this is it, is that is that what I gave Charizard? Yeah, special you give special attack and special sp and speed. But I, it's not timid. It's it's hasty. What does hasty do again? Plus speed minus defense. But actually, what I want is uh, what what is one that can hold on. I gotta bring up natures, so I want one that's gonna give me the most special attack without taking away from my attack. The only ones I know is modest. That takes out that takes that attack away. So hold on, special attack minus defense is mild. Are you still in here? Yeah, I'm just looking at some Pokemon on your team, just looking at move sets and okay, stuff. Okay, because I feel like I felt like I was talking to myself. No, 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 I was listening. I was listening. Mild. All right, let's let's see. Mild Dragon Pulse. What does that do? Two hit KO. Thirty-five point five. Thirty point five chance to two hit KO. Interesting. What if I break social protocol and make it adamant? <laughs> and then, uh, Earthquake. Not dragging. Well, I'm, I want to see Earthquake first. No, that's not going to work. Okay, uh, so Dragon Claw. Oh, that's actually better. Dude. Set, yeah, what's up? Set with Kate. An adamant Mega Charizard with what we gave him, like in EVs, mm -hmm. using Dragon yeah. Claw mm -hmm. on Gudra is seventy-four point two chance to hit KO. That's a, that. Mm -hmm. Those are odds that I would like to go with. Then go for Dragon Claw, man. I will make him adamant. Oh, that is good. All right, and plus now, uh, so what do I take out? Earthquake, Air Slash. Hmm. So if you get rid of Earthquake, how do you, you can't check that um, Arcanine or Lantern or I got, I, got, I got rid of Air Slash. Okay, yeah. I think that was the best play. Okay, so that this is the better V-Rage. Now, Forges, uh, <laughs> we did that. What item should I give it? Uh, you want to give it Leftovers? Yeah, why not? Just call, to heal up. Call it Sniff, because it's a flower. Uh, Sniff. Alright, so what's the next Pokemon that we should put on this team? 
Do you want to run Sigilyph? Sigilyph. 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 Actually, I think I want to run Braviary. That'd be good. I think I want. Can he set up like hazards with that team? Any who can set up hazards on that team? I know Gavantula has Sticky Web. Get Sticky Web, but what, who else? Mm -hmm. Hmm. He might leave with Galvantula. He might leave with Galvantula. Just set up Sticky Web and just screw you over. Does uh, the Sticky Web? Do you think he'd leave with that? I don't know, but I'm gonna put. He gets Defog, right? Yeah. So I'm gonna put Defog on my Braviary. Because like one thing I was just thinking about is like if he does lead with that setup, uh, you can throw in Sigilyph. Ha set up a magic coat so it just bounces back the move right back at him and just screw him over that way. And then you, the rest of the moves for Sigil Lift are just set up moves to protect yourself and just uh, tease the opponent. Like magic coat, Thunder Wave, Light Screen, and Reflect just there to set up only, purely. But that's dependent. Uh, what? Did I cut off or something? No, 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 no. I, I, I just wasn't paying attention. I heard oh. Sigilyph, Magic Guard, something. No, Sigilyph, if you like lead with um, Sigilyph, uh, throw up a Magic Coat, and then uh, that'll basically bounce back any non-damaging moves. So if he tries to set up on you, or he can't, it'll just go back to him, I think. And then you just have Thunder Wave, Light Scream, and Reflect to set off the moveset and just set up purely with Sigilyph well, just to set you off in a good... This Pokemon can only be damaged by direct attacks. What the, what the, what's the, what does Magic Guard do? I guess you can't get, you can't hit it from like, you can't like get hit from, I guess like, you know, Sandstorm and stuff like that, like direct attacks, they're not like, they're not direct, they're like. Alright, Magic Coat. So, magic Guard ability. I'm looking this up right now. I'm gonna give him Psychic so he can actually attack. And wait, fuck light screen. Light screen. I don't want to give him light screen. Basically, it won't get hurt by any entry hazards or like um, the weather and stuff like that. All right. Life or leaf. I'm gonna give him like the most like retarded move set ever. Who? Sigilyph. Oh, you're actually putting him on the team? You don't have to. It was just a suggestion. Well, I mean, it's not retarded. Magic coat, air slash, dazzling gleam, and psychic. Okay. Yeah. Psychic for sla Psychic and air, sla air Slash for Stab. Magic Coat. Like, I sent him out first turn, Magic Coat. And Air Slash, Psychic, yeah. Dazzling Gleam. I'm going to invest everything I have in speed. Give him a plus speed nature. And then uh, in special attack. And a little bit of HP. Uh, so 322 speed. I'm going to outspeed pretty much anything he brings out. Also, so th what are you, 325... What? Uh, what are you running? Magic coat and what are the other moves? Air slash, dazzling gleam, dazzling gleam, and psychic. Okay, nice. So, um, okay, twenty-three minute video for just four Pokemon. Well, three technically. All right. So, what item should I give this Sigilyph? What ability are you going with? Magic guard. Magic guard. Okay. Hmm. You're clearly are you there? You're doing attack. You're not really setting up. You're there for attacks, basically, right? Well, I have magic coat. But wait, doesn't magic guard like? Hold on. Doesn't Espeon get magic guard? He has Espeon? No, 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 no. I'm asking you. Doesn't? No, he doesn't. I guess magic bounce. I think. Yeah, that's what I was thinking of. All, da Pyramid, all damage. This includes the damage from the life orb without removing the boost. And entry hazard, status element, elements, and moves that hurt. Yo, I can give it a life orb. Yeah, that's what I was just thinking about. Give it a life orb because you're not doing any attack. You're, you're attacking more than defending like what its usual role is. It's mainly there to like store power if you really want to do that. I did that. It was so fun. But holders attacks. Is that ho attacks and special attacks? What? Life Orb. Does it boost special I attacks too? Holder attacks. I think I, it's just attacks. I think it's just both. 
I'm gonna anyway. check it just, just to make sure. I've never used Life Orb before. Life Orb Pokemon. The damage from the moves the holder is increased by 30%. Does it, does it boost the power of moves but at cost some HP? Damage of the moves are usually increased by 30%. Alright, so. Oh. I mean, they, they they did an event. Wait, no, wait. What am I reading? Oh, okay, here. Yeah, they did an event for um, in Gen Five, a Life Orb, uh, Kingdra, and all its entire move set is special. So I guess it boosts special attack too. I think it does both. Yeah. I'm gonna give it life orb. All right, and I'm gonna call him uh, Destroyer of Worlds. <laughs> nice. All right, now Braviary. It's gonna be Defog, just in case. Uh, I'm gonna give him. Wait, a... you gave life orb right to Sigliff? Yeah. Okay. Are you like writing it down or something? I'm just making sure. I was like, I'm just switching back and forth to Pokemon on uh, Showdown. Okay. And different stuff. Um, so, uh, Kenai, Sheer Force, or Defiant? Sheer Force, I guess. Yeah. Defiant is good, but only if I get lowered, so. Plus, I, I put Brave Board, Bra Brave Board, Brave Bird on Braviary. So right now, yeah, his, so right now his moveset is Defog and Brave Bird. Wait, wait, Sheer Force gets rid of this, uh, the recoil, right? Or no? Uh, is that a secondary effect technically, or no? I mean, that's what I wasn't sure about. I'm like, yes. Does that count? No. Wait. I don't know. Uh, hold on. Uh, sheer force Pokemon. All right. Uh, ability Dex should tell me the moves that are effect. Yeah. Sheer force also has the ability of negating the recoil of item Life Orb when it's used on a move with. Which sheer force effects. It does not lose recoil in the move Flare Blitz. What about Brave Bird? Uh, no. Effe attacks affected. Brave Bird is not in this list. So you don't take damage? Or you do? Wait, wait. I do take damage. See, this is the thing: is that uh, sheer force affects the the moves I have here, and they all have like secondary effects. Like the target may also lower speed. So instead of lowering speed, it would just do more damage. Yeah. But Brave Bird. But it doesn't get rid of recoil. No, that I think that's reckless. But then, okay. but then, how did my Embor die? Because <laughs> it has reckless. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I had reckless. How did it die? I don't know. All right, uh, let's continue on. All right, so you give it sheer force. Uh, so then let's let's choice band it since it's gonna be, no wait no because then if I choice focus band it, stash focus stash if I choice band it into defog that's gonna be fucking worthless. Uh oh, choice band yo. Heat wave. I'm I mean not choice band. Uh, focus sash. I mean focus sash. I put focus sash, but I put heat wave on him. Well, bulk up focus sash and then just do damage. <laughs> I'm not bulking up. You're not bulking. Up. Zen headbutt for his his poison types, and heat wave because uh, I wanted to put heat. The wave. Excadrill. He might ha he's gonna run Stone Edge on that. Well, I mean, if Charizard goes down, then I could just like send in Braviary, and then even yeah. even with low special attack, Heat Wave is still gonna kill Scizor. Because it's quite effective, yeah. So, so what's the move set? Defog, Brave Bird, Heat Waves, and Headbutt. Defog, Brave Bird, Heat Wave. Nice. If only you had a move that boosts your speed. You don't even learn agility as a bird. Kind of sucks. 
Does Tailwind affect you or no? Uh, it just says allies. Yeah, it does affect you. But I'm not oh, gonna, it does? I, I'm, yeah, but I'm not going to teach Tailwind. Uh, Alright, uh, so I will call him... Tomahawk. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I don't know. Just us. Just us. Yeah, instead of justice, it's just us. Just us. Just us. So that makes four Pokemon? No, I'm not going to call him that. I'm going to call him a uh, piece of crap, because that's what the America is. Oh, JK. Uh, oh, wait, I forgot. Oh, yeah, you're Canada. I forgot. Oh, yeah, you're a Canadian. Keep forgetting. Bulky physical sweeper. Yeah. All right. Let's do that. It's lonely. So we have two Pokemon so left. Oh, wow. Four in. Okay. Now, basically, the thing is, your fire types just check... OU, uh, a third of you, you, and then your a grass type moves check one from each tier. Uh, the the Gudra is gonna be annoying because it's probably gonna get like what? He's probably gonna throw out like a lantern or something. See that you have a grass type move coming and switch into Gudra with Sap Tipper. I can see that as a total possibility. What other moves does Gudra get? I feel like the biggest threat for you is Gudra. That that Mega Caesar is not a threat. I think it's like Gudra. I think at least. Let me see what Gudra gets. Gudra gets Sap Sip for hydration when it's raining. And it gets Gooey, which uh, has their speed lowered by one if they make contact with this Pokemon. All right. Uh, so uh, let's listen to what I'm saying right now before you continue. Um, I'm going to have a Volcarona with Hidden Power Dragon. <laughs> nice. Wait, no, that doesn't matter. It's not gonna. It's not going to do much. Never mind. Uh, you have to be uh, physical with this Gudra. So basically, Dragon Claw it. Yeah. But, like. I, I'm going to put Volcarona on the team. I'm going to give him Double Edge. I'm going to make a physical Volcarona. Flame Charge. I don't know. Flare Blitz. Not Flame, flame Charge. Uh, let's give him Poison Jab. U turn. Let's get rid of poison jab because that's not gonna do much. What the hell is Volkraken? Volkraken. Oh, wild charge. Yeah. All right. When you type up a V O L, it comes up as a Pokemon for Cap. <laughs> what? Volkraken. So what are you gonna give it? Um. Oh, uh, that's that's like a a, a made up mon. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, you're gonna be a flame charge. Uh, it's going to be a. Uh, Physical Volcarona. So, Flame Charge, Double Edge. Wild Charge um, and U Turn. Okay. A Wild Charge? Did yeah. You... And, okay. uh. You know what? I'm going to Choice Bandit. Cause That'd be good. Its attack is 240. With the Choice Bandit, it's going to make it more powerful. When you go full, right? Oh, this is a special, that's why, yeah. Are you gonna go Adamant? I did. Adamant Volcarona, full physical two, move set. Two forty. I'm gonna call it. Sunbug, so original. All right, one one last Pokemon. Yo, imagine a swarm. Uh, you know, swarm how it boosts your attack uh, when it's one thirty HP by one point five times. Yeah. Imagine when you have Swarm active, when your HP is that low, and you just you turn as a physical Volcarona, just and you're fast, just come in, get out, come in, get out, every time. That'd be devastating. Yeah. Shiny looks pretty good. I feel right, like so I feel like if if they ever did a uh, like a, either a fire, grass, or water uh, bug. Starter, it would have like blaze, torrent, or overgrow, and then its inability would, would be swarm. Like yeah. they, they they would do that. Yeah, they would. Cause swarm is basically its bug type, whatever those abilities. Yeah, basically. So you have Pyro Trevenin, Polyrath, okay. Ebi Palm. Dude, I already, I already have. I already, dude. My team is extremely, extremely weak to uh, electric. That, dude, that, 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 uh, that lantern comes in and wrecks my entire, yeah, I give Angelo too, but I mean, I got counters for both, but 
What I want to do is put in either either Ch Trevenant, chestnut. Trevenant, or, or Chestnut. Trevenant. Or Let me chestnut. look up Chestnut. So you assault vest Chestnut if you want to, expecting those electric type moves to come in because they're both. I want to see something. Uh, Yo, he gets Dragon Claw. Who gets? And he's Dragon a physical Claw. chestnut, and he's a physical attacker as well. Uh, <laughs> I'm looking at the moves that bulletproof prevent. And it, it's. I mean. Electro Ball would be prevented. Focus Blast would be prevented. Energy Ball. Gyro Ball. Ice Ball. Magnet Bomb. Mist Ball. Mud Bomb. Octazooka. Rock Wrecker. Searing Shot. Seed Bomb. Shadow Ball. Sludge Bomb. Weather Ball. Zap Cannon. Acid Spray. Why? Aura Sphere. Barrage. Bullet Seed. Egg Bomb. Yeah. Bulletproof chestnut. And get all this crap out of here. Okay, hold on. I want. I want to see. Is. Because uh, I'm gonna run him, offensive. Adamant. All right, so um, Scoodra, uh, he you said he you said he said, uh, you said he got Dragon Claw. Yeah, he got Dragon Claw, Chestnut, and he's physical attacker. Uh, all right, so let's see, guaranteed two hit KO on Gudra. With max attack, guaranteed two hit KO. That's nasty. What if I? What if I give him what's what's the choice item that boosts attack? That's the ability. Hold on. Band. It's the choice band? I think so. Yeah, I think so. Forty three point eight chance to one hit KO. So if I get a max roll with Dragon Claw, I, I one shot Gudra. With a chestnut. Yeah, dude, that'd be pretty cool. I just saw him like, wait, he gets Dragon Claw? That checks Gudra. You probably think you're going for Stab Sipper or something, you know? Switch it in, be like, psych! Dragon Claw. And Dragon Claw does a lot of damage to anything on his team, technically. Except that Caesar and Excadrill. But, I mean, get those out of the way. And, uh, well, I mean, he does have a Wigglytuff. Wait, how much is. Is Choice Band better than Life Orb when it comes to damage, or no? I think it's the same. Oh, yeah, thing. it's 1.3 times 1. Yeah, it's 1.3. Yeah. So that's not bad. That's actually pretty fun to just run. Are you going to run Dragon Claw on Chestnut? Yeah. Choice Band? Yeah. Oh, nice. well, wait, hold on. Life Orb is 1.3, Choice Band is 1.5. Yeah, 1.5. So what, you're gonna run um, Dragon Claw, uh, Drain Punch, Earthquake, Energy Ball? I don't know. Or, not Energy Ball. Well, he doesn't have any physical grass type moves, except... Uh, wood Hammer? Wood Hammer. Seed, yeah, Wood Hammer. Seed Bomb? Oh yeah, those two, yeah. I don't know, I'm so, gonna give any him... Idea? I'm gonna give him Seed Drag Bomb. So Dragon Claw, Seed Bomb, and what about the last two? Uh, Drain Punch? Or do you want to run Power Up Punch just to get the extra, if you get, if you're able to rock get up a Pokemon? Rock Slide? Okay, Rock Slide. Well, Rock Slide checks... Galvantula. And Arcanine, but Arcanine you don't want to throw Chestnut into that, that much. And you can run, you can run bolt, a Drain Punch or, bolt, uh, or a Power Up Punch just for the extra HP or boost and attack. Brick Break. break. Okay. Going all out, bulky band. Wait, why are you gonna run brick break? Because. You think he's gonna set up? Why? Why would I care if he sets up or not? I'm in there no, to I'm saying, attack and. Then... No, I'm saying if you're gonna run brick break, why not try running drain punch? It does the same amount of damage and has same accuracy, except drain punch heals you too at the same time. Instead of destroying screens, if you're not worried about that. 
okay. mean, if you were, if you okay. want, just get heals up. I mean, that's just a suggestion. This is just a suggestion. You can run break break. I'm just saying, like, if you want to heal instead of destroying the screen. Do you think that 226 speed will outspeed? It'll outspeed Gudra. When hasty, will go 249. <laughs> Yeah, but Hasty doesn't boost attack. I need the attack boost or else it's two hit KO. I need him to be adamant. Oh, you need him to be adamant? With adamant, it's a two hit KO or a one hit KO? With adamant, it's, if it's a high roll, it's a one hit KO. It's a, there's a 43.8 chance to a one hit KO. I will take those odds. So you have to run adamant. I mean, you got 227 speed. So 226. Oh. Uh, no, wait, hold on. 227. Yeah, 227. Okay, so that's that that that's that's what I'm running. That's my team. No, what would Gudra run? Gudra runs at two. 207. 59. If it runs at full speed. Yeah, if it runs at full speed, right. But I feel like he's gonna do investments in um, special attack and special defense Probably. or HP. Probably. I see him going bulky. I don't see him putting any speed into this because he just. Yeah, I don't think he'll expect chest not to run dragon claw. Yeah, maybe he'll not. expect a sap zipper switch and then, or he might go gooey just to slow you down. But that wouldn't matter as long as you get hit off uh, one move on it. You'll do a lot of damage because you're a, you're physical and this has horrible defense. So yeah, you got your check right there. So I'm calling him Boomcha. Boomcha. All right, let's so, let's see if, the, if this team is valid. Yeah, okay, good. Valid for OU. Nice. Are you worried about that Wiggly Tough at all? Uh, drain punch. Oh wait. Well, that does, that does that does neutral. It's a damage. psychic. It's a fair. It's a very normal, right? Yeah, so. it does normal damage. But I can take it out. Uh, hold on. Let's see. What do I have that can take out a fairy type? I don't have any. Well, I have toxic. Really tough does get like fire blast and uh, uh, would he run a water type move? I don't think he would, because like at that point you can just run um Charizard or uh, your Volcarona, and I mean he might run Blizzard and I, get off neutral damage. I but... I changed um I changed double edge on Volcarona to poison jab, and now I got a count a hit a counter for his really tough. There we go. There we go. You resist f f uh, fairy, and you can get some same type super type super effective moves off. Nice. Yeah, not not super time moves off. Super effective. Yeah. Super Let's validate effective. now. Yeah, it's still valid. All right. So, uh, it's forty-two minutes. I think that's good. We got yeah. we got a team build. You wanna you wanna have a quick battle after I, I click uh, stop recording just to test it out. Like last yeah, time. sure. Let's do it. All right. Yeah, let's do it. So let's end off the video and then we'll do that. All right. So, um, if you guys enjoyed, uh. You can click subscribe, like, and comment. I don't know. Just comment whatever you want. Uh, don't check out V-Rage. He's not worth your time. But his link will be in the description if you want to for some reason. Yeah, don't don't, don't check me out because Alex said so. And um, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching and bye-bye. Peace. Don't interrupt me when I'm doing my outro, man. <laughs>